Pro. So this is the first Pro line of the Samsung Galaxy Note series, and this is this guy is even bigger than the previous Galaxy Note that was big enough. So this guy's got a 12 inch of a WQXGA display and the and the octa core processor. That's a big little architecture with the full HD playback and everything. 8 megapixel, 3 gigabytes of RAM. But we actually want to open it up for now. So let's do that. And uh, yeah. So Samsung has gone a step further with the Pro lineup. So, well, this is basically a larger version of the previous well-known Galaxy Note 10.1 2014 edition. Uh, so there's that. And uh, let's take a look at the packaging. This tablet is so big that it has enormous space in the packaging. So this is a USB 3.0 cable that is compatible with the external hard drive and source. And this is the manual and the USB charger with the two amps of the output as you can see right there. So, and the little uh, replaceable tips for your S Pen. And um, let's get to this enormous guy. Alrighty. Screen protectors and um, turning it on while it turns on. Let's take a look at the um, buttons and source. There's a power key on the top with the volume rocker and the infrared port for the remote controlling your telly and um, and a, a, a 3.5 millimeters of headphone jack with the speaker right there and the that's um, on the right is another uh, speaker and the USB 3.0 port right there get the focus there and the micro SD card slot that is expandable up to 64 gigabytes. And on the back is an 8 megapixel camera with the LED flash and the Samsung logo and the... Hold on, let me fill this off. And the there's an S Pen right there. Uh, the main feature of the Samsung Galaxy Notes. And the the back cover right here is uh, has actually got better. Starting with the Galaxy Note 3, they have this um, leather likely finish on the plastic back cover. And the Galaxy Note 10.1 uh, to 2014 edition was a bit of an exception with this plastic finish. It wasn't coated with that rubber likely finish. And um, this, the newer Galaxy Note Pro does. And uh, it feels pretty nice. And uh, I, I think Samsung's got a made a really, really nice choice of doing that leather likely finish. And uh, with that on site, this guy is a Galaxy Note 10.1 2014 edition. This is a 12 inch and a 10 inch device, not a 10 and an 8.9 like we used to have a few years ago. And um, wow, this is like really big. And since not most, uh, many of you would have a 2014 edition, let's get an iPad right there. And this is how uh, bigger the 10 point uh, Note Pro is compared to the iPad Air. So this is an iPad Air and the Note 2014 is just about identical with the iPad Air. So you can see how big it is. Alrighty, enough of that. Um, it's got a new interface and uh, let me switch that language to uh, English for the English speaker folks. And um, there we go. Alrighty. So it's got an enormous, gigantic WQXJ resolution display. We'll get to that. Before we do that, let's have a sneak peek at the Samsung's magazine user interface. And um, I don't know how to use this guy for now. Uh, uh, we, we've heard that um, Samsung has put a lot of effort on that, but I um, don't know how to do, uh, how to play with that just so yet. So let's skip that. And it comes with the latest Android. Um, the icons over here has got a uh, cleaner, flat look too, and uh, that's a good thing. And it comes with the latest Android that is a 4.4.2 with the Android KitKat, and um, that's a good thing. Samsung is pretty much well known for its updates. So with that, um, the first thing I heard with the Galaxy Note Pro with that 12 inch of an enormous display was that God, it's gonna be as big as my laptop. So I actually brought my laptop and um, it indeed is as big as my laptop. So this is my 12 inch uh, ThinkPad X200 and um, with, the, with the keyboard open, this totally covers up the laptop itself. Uh, it's losing focus. It totally covers up the keyboard. So you can pretty much imagine how big this 12 inch tablet is. Alrighty. This was Galaxy Note 10. Point, uh, Galaxy Note Pro. God, I 
keep uh, putting numbers on the behind of the thingy. Since this is an unboxing, we can't really go into the, the lots of details. The details and the uh, in-depth review of this guy will follow soon, so keep focus. In order to do that, you guys gotta tap on there to subscribe to my channel, uh, Under KG Show. This was Under KG. Thank you always for watching, and we'll see you guys in the follow-up review uh, pretty soon. Thank you. Bye.